ranking the full RTX 50 series lineup from best to worst. And this could get a little bit controversial. For me, the worst 50 series GPU is easy. It's gotta be this, the RTX 5060 Ti 8 gigabyte. It only comes with eight gigabytes, which is just not enough for the power and capability of the 5060 Ti. And for the price, it makes absolutely zero cents. In position number seven for me has to be the RTX 5060. This isn't a terrible GPU and for $299 you're gonna get quite a lot of graphics card for your money. The problem is it's just not that much quicker than the last gen 4060 and if things weren't bad enough it gets beat out by the equivalently priced 9060 XT 8 gig across the board. In position number six for me has to be the 16 gigabyte RTX 5060 Ti. It's just too expensive, like way too expensive. Vex and performance is actually okay, but when this thing is going to cost you significantly more than a 9060 XT 16 gig and nearly as much as a 9070, which is a just a way better card in every way, you shouldn't buy one. 5060 Ti this generation? Just disappointing. In that position number five is going to be this, the RTX 5050. It's got eight gigs of VRAM, which for me is fine on a card that's aimed entirely at 1080p medium settings. And it does provide better performance than the Intel Arc B570. The problem is that you're just better off picking up a secondhand 4060 or even a secondhand 3060 from years ago. It's just not that quick. And for that reason, it's a hard card to recommend when spending just a little bit more can really prove to be valuable. In position number four is this, the RTX 5070 Ti. Now I actually don't dislike this GPU. It's a little bit light on video memory and the price point is quite expensive. I think the upcoming 5070 Ti Super with a bit more VRAM and hopefully a better price could make this a great option. It's not a bad card, it's just a little too expensive. For me next up is this, the RTX 5070. Now I actually regard this as being higher up on my list than I would have previously. And the reason is price, you can buy it for MSRP in the UK and the US right now. And you can't do that for its AMD competition, the 9070, which in theory should be the same price or cheaper. In second place for the crown of my second favorite GPU is gonna be this, the RTX 5080. Now you might be thinking, James, you've just left the 5090 till last because it's the most expensive and the most powerful. And that's not the case. The RTX 5080 is one of my favorite 50 series cards. AMD have nothing to compete with it. It gives you great technology. The performance is fantastic. The prices are still a bit inflated, but again, that's because of a lack of competition from AMD. The 5090 is my favorite, not just because it's amazingly quick, but because it's a real marvel of engineering. This founder's edition design comes in an extraordinarily compact form factor with great efficiency, great temperatures, and top tier 4K performance. AMD have nothing to compete at the high end, and that's kind of a shame. What do you think of my list? Did I get any cards in the wrong order? I'm sure you'll let me know in the comments below.